horror fans. Tonight, I'm going to tell you a story that you shouldn't hear alone. It's about Bloody Mary. I know you've heard the legend, but trust me, this one's different. A few years ago, there was a girl named Emily. She was obsessed with urban legends and supernatural tales. One night, she decided to test the Bloody Mary legend for herself. You know the drill? Stand in front of a mirror, light a single candle, and chant Bloody Mary three times. Emily didn't believe anything would happen. She thought it was just a silly game. So, in the dead of night, she snuck into her bathroom, lit a candle, and stared into the mirror. With a nervous laugh, she said, Bloody Mary! Bloody Mary! Bloody Mary! At first, nothing happened. She felt a wave of relief and almost laughed at her own fear. But then, the candle flickered violently and the room grew cold. Her breath became visible in the air, and she felt a chill run down her spine. Emily's reflection in the mirror began to distort. Her face twisted and elongated, and her eyes turned black. She tried to turn away, but her feet felt glued to the floor. Suddenly, a figure appeared behind her reflection, a woman with long, dark hair and a blood-stained face. The woman whispered, You called me! Emily's heart pounded as she tried to scream, but no sound came out. The figure reached through the mirror, grabbing Emily's shoulder with icy fingers. Pain shot through her body as she felt her skin tearing. Emily's parents found her the next morning, unconscious on the bathroom floor, covered in scratches, and with a look of sheer terror on her face. She never spoke about that night again. But every time she looked in a mirror, she felt a presence watching her. So, next time you think about summoning Bloody Mary, remember Emily's story. Some legends are better left alone. Sweet dreams, if you can.